In the vast expanse of our cosmos, there lurk mysteries beyond the grasp of human understanding. One such mystery is the enigma of dark matter and dark energy, entities that elude our perception, yet constitute approximately 95% of our universe. Now imagine a world where the unseen makes up the majority, where the visible is but a fraction of reality. This is not a work of science fiction, but the perplexing reality of our universe. A reality that renowned theoretical physicist Michio Kaku has devoted his life to deciphering. Kaku's theories on dark matter are groundbreaking. He posits that dark matter is not just elusive, but it is in fact an alternate universe. A shadow world that exists parallel to ours. It's comprised of shadow particles, shadow galaxies, even shadow people. Kaku suggests that we are like fish swimming in a shallow pond, only aware of the universe above when it interferes with our world, our pond. Now, let's pivot our attention to a text penned over a millennium ago, the Quran. One might wonder what could an ancient religious text possibly contribute to a discussion about dark matter? It turns out quite a lot. The Quran, in various verses, alludes to the existence of unseen entities. Take, for instance, the verse from Surah Al-Mulk, verse 3, where it states, He who created the seven heavens in layers, you do not see any incoherence in the creation of the Most Merciful. Then look again, can you see any gaps? This verse suggests an ordered universe, layered in its creation, which aligns with the modern understanding of multiple dimensions and parallel universes. Another verse, Surah al-Baqarah, verse 255, known as Ayat al-Kursi, states, His kursi extends over the heavens and the earth, and their preservation tires him not. Here, kursi is often interpreted as knowledge or power that extends over the visible and invisible universe, possibly hinting at the unseen dark matter and dark energy that permeate the cosmos. In essence, the Quran seems to suggest the existence of unseen entities possibly referring to dark matter and dark energy, while Michio Kaku's theories provide a scientific framework to understand these unseen entities. To summarize, the mystery of dark matter and dark energy has captivated scientists and thinkers for decades. Theoretical physicist Michio Kaku offers a revolutionary perspective, suggesting that dark matter might indeed be a shadow universe parallel to ours. Intriguingly, the Quran, an ancient religious text, seems to echo similar sentiments, hinting at layered heavens and an unseen dominion extending across the universe. The convergence of these perspectives is fascinating. It draws a line between science and religion, and hints at the possibility that perhaps these two domains are not as disparate as they seem. Maybe they are two sides of the same coin, each enhancing our understanding of the universe and the mysteries it harbors. While the quest to unravel the secrets of dark matter and dark energy continues, one thing remains certain. The universe, in all its complexity and grandeur, holds more mysteries than our minds can fathom. But isn't that what makes the journey of discovery so exciting? After all, it's the mystery that keeps the wonder alive.